Hello, a warm welcome, and this is the scene here at the Zignali Duna Park. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It is Borussia Dortmund facing Eintracht Frankfurt. Hi, right, Derek, thank you. Well, both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to start off the game really quickly. Really attack the opposition, put them on the back foot, see what comes of that. Hopefully we get a good game. This is the lineup for Dortmund. The vastly experienced Marvin Hitz is the goalkeeper. Nico Schurz plays with Thomas Meunier as fullbacks. Thomas Delaney plays alongside Mahmoud Dahoud in the centre of the pitch. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. the starting 11 for Eintracht Frankfurt. Wing-backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing-back, Lee? Not at all under Bruce Rock. It's a very, very demanding role, as we can see. The full-backs are exposed both offensively and defensively. Lots of support inside them, but going forward, they need to try and get the ball into the box for the two up front. An interesting match stands ahead of us. Dortmund kick off. Dahoud. The ball with Marco Reus. Delaney. On to Holland. It's a good Dortmund move in the making. They couldn't maintain possession. And an astute piece of defending. Rode. Daichi Kamada. Luka Jovic. Oh, great vision. Well, as we see again here, it's a beauty of a ball over the top. And then just look at the way he opens up his body here. Times it perfectly and catches it so sweetly. It's a wonderful strike. Well, back on the way here, it's going to be interesting to see whether or not Dortmund can find the right reply. Jaden Sancho. Minier. Now Thomas Delaney. Holland. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And unable to keep the ball. Delaney. Torgan Azar. Holland. Good tackle, take it away. Barcock. And he takes on the shot. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at his best. But then there's plenty to do from there. He's hit it so well. Lots of pace, lots of power. And the keeper just can't react in time. Great strike. Well, a 
second goal for them here. Luka Jovic. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Rode. And now Ndika. Luka Jovic. So... This is looking threatening. Well, Dortmund have it once again. They might be able to get in now. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. the keeper well, he's given a corner the referee <whistles> and firing it into the area and the keeper was up to the task well, a corner right on the back of the last one. <laughs> Royce taking this one. A decisive clearance it was. Delaney. Chan. and I wonder how he waltzes past the defender so easily and when he gets through to the keeper he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think a lovely finish as they kick off again 2-1 the current state of affairs just not looking confident in possession Erling Haaland nice. really vital interception here As you can see, the visitors haven't had too much of the ball, but they won't mind with that. They're winning this game. They're sucking their opponents onto them. And with the pace they've got in midfield and up front, they're really causing problems. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Dahoud. On the ball, Torgan Azar. How about the cross? Useful ball to the near post. And you need your defender to take charge. Azar. On to Holland. Well, there it is. Can you believe this? From two down, they now find themselves level. Well, here's the goal again. It's a clever ball through and a great run. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully.
Well, as the game has restarted, we're left to reflect on four goals. 2-2. Two -two. Well, the pass not finding its target. Delaney. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, there's never a bad time to score a goal, but just before half-time can be crucial. And he's got his team back in this game. What can he produce in the second half? The two teams have switched around. And are ready now for the second half. Not showing good defensive judgment. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Excellent defending. Showing a real desire to win it back. To Hood. Well, body in the way. Emre Can. Sancho now. Delaney. Slipshod passing. And the counter-attack is on, options available. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Torgan Azar. It's with Dahoud. Chance to do damage. Could play it in. And well, they keep the ball moving. an effective clearance half an hour remaining then Kostic Andres Silva can he convert the goal appeared to be at his mercy but defenders always have a part to play in these situations. Well, if you can't block the shot, put the forward off, and that's exactly what happened there, but it's just off target. Minier. Now Minier. Might be onto something with that ball. Decent position for Dortmund to be in. Well, he read that. Brandt! It's in! And this really takes your breath away! A comeback and a half! Well, here we can 
see, Derek, from this better angle, it's all about the technique. When you're volleying a ball, it's all about timing. Let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection. And there you go, in the back of the net. You can't really say defences are on top. 3 2. Gibril So. Dortmund throw in here. Emre Can. Dahoud. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Reina is with Dahoud. And the attack looks promising. Went in strongly to win the ball. In position here to protect the ball. Dangerous looking through ball. Fruitful looking attack. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Crossed into the penalty area. And it's gone behind for the corner. And now the delivery. Excellent block. Well, pressure building. Another corner. Played into the centre of the box. Foiling them effectively. Ndika. It looks promising. A really top notch piece of defending. So a throw in here. Aydin Hrustic. Well, let's see about the cross. And still dangerous. This could square the game. What a vital intervention. Disappointing pass. And forward they go, chasing the game. And giving the ball away. Well, Dortmund just have to try and hang on here. The fans are trying their best to see them over the line. Hazard. It needs an accurate cross. And now they have the ball back. Andre Silva. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Andre Silva. And they've won possession again. Brandt. Look at this again, magical football on the break, surprise is the key, and he gets up to the header, and quite frankly it's a lovely finish, brilliant goal. Well the goal again, albeit from a different angle.
So the current scoreline, 4-2. And that will do it. The referee blows his whistle and three points for Borussia Dortmund. Lee, overall, how would you assess their performance? Yeah, their two-goal advantage in the end was just reward for their good play today for me. Worthy winners. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.